Hello Quimbeck here, as promised I've gathered up 100 mini llamas and I recorded the process of opening so we could together look deeper into it to find out what kind of drops we could expect from mini llamas. It feels like mini llamas are in range of players who do not want to spend real money and they wish to grind them through in-game quests. It would be nice to actually understand what kind of drops we could expect from those and how does it work. So I will tell you what I've got out of 100 llamas. I've opened them up in portions of 10 because this is the maximum amount you can choose to open up at single time, single round, so we have 10 rounds, 10 llamas each. I intend to make my own analysis and I'm interested in certain type of data here, but if you want to gather up something that I didn't mention or I won't mention in, in my video, just feel free to watch it because I'm putting entire process of opening into the video so you can check it out yourself. Also I will be like summing it up, there's a small presentation after llamas are opened, so feel free to use it as well for your own conclusions. If you are wondering how did I get 100 mini llamas in the first place, I recommend you to check out my previous video, previous Fortnite guides that I've made and uploaded on this channel. That's quite easy to find because it's titled how to farm mini llamas super fast. If you are too lazy or have problems to locate this video, I will be trying to put a card here in this moment of this video, so you could just click it and go back there if you need to. And let's get back to the opening now. I know that most of you will be interested in, in results of this opening instead of me smashing all those llamas. So let me just start with explaining what did I get from those llamas and later we proceed to the opening part. So if some of you are still interested just stay a bit longer to watch the entire video. But for those of you who want the data first, there it goes. My first question was how many silver and gold llamas I can expect out of pool of 100 mini llamas. In my case 100 mini llamas gave me 95 normal ones and 5 silver llamas, so that would be around 5% in this opening round. In total I received 320 cards, normal mini llama when you hit it, when you open it, grants you only 3 cards, but if it procs to the silver version, silver version in total gives you 7 cards, so it's like 4 cards increase per proc. Not sure about the gold proc yet because I didn't get a single one in this batch. Okay, let's discuss the drop now. I received a lot of survivors, defenders, weapons and traps. Mostly survivors. Sadly, they didn't go above uncommon so often. Out of 48 survivors, 34 of them were common, 12 of them were uncommon and only 2 of them without rare. Then we've got defenders, 25 of them dropped. 22 were common, 3 of them uncommon, nothing above. Weapons, 39 weapons, 21 of them went common, 16 uncommon. Also we've got 3 rare weapons and 1 epic weapon, this is the only epic drop I've got out of 100 llamas. Next traps, 25 of them and it's like 50-50, 12 of them were common, 13 were uncommon. There's also a small chance of getting a hero, I received two of them and they went out on uncommon grade, so that's like the lowest grade for a hero, right? Next, lead survivors. This is even worse than heroes, I got only one of 100 at uncommon grade. We've got a lot of those XP cards, we've got survivor, schematic and hero XP and those dropped in numbers, they've dropped a lot. Looks like XP cards have around 50 to 60 percent drop chance. I've got 53 Survivor XP cards, 57 Schematic XP cards and 56 Hero XP cards. XP cards out of Mini Llamas, they come in 4 types. One of them, the lowest, gives you only 200 XP, there's 500, 800 and 1500 as well. But it looks like most of those cards, they came out as 500 and 800, but there was also a small chance that you will get a bit less, which is 200, or a bit more, which is 1500. There's one more item that's dropping here, it's called Pure Drop of Rain, I believe it's a crafting item, it's a resource, and I've got 14 of those. Most of the time when I had like 10 llamas to open, I received one drop of rain or two drops of rain. So in my eyes, chance for dropping of those in out of mini llamas is between 10 to 20%. And those are my conclusions after opening 100 of those mini llamas. I would appreciate if you guys that are interested in this type of data 
would comment below and tell me if I missed something that you are interested in or is it something that you would want to see again because I'm not sure if I should gather up and record those openings and proceed with gathering my data here or it's, it's not desired by anyone, nobody wants it so I shouldn't do it. Let me know in the comments if this is something you want to know about those llamas or not because 100 is a beginning but the question is if it's needed or not, that's what I'm asking about. Okay, and if there's anything else that you want to know about those llamas and I didn't tell you about in this video, there's a still process of smashing them going on in the background. Once this is done, you will also see a small summary of my inventory, highlighting those cards which are new in terms of my survivors and weapons and so on. So feel free to check out the rest of the video. As for me, this is where I say goodbye. Thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing and see you later.